This is another example on calculating the test statistic, but this time this has to do with the population mean. Now our claim here is the mean pulse rate of adult males is equal to 69 beats per minute. For a random sample of 150 adult males, the, pull, the mean pulse rate is 70.4 beats per minute, and the standard deviation is 10.9 beats per minute. Find the value of the test statistic. Okay, so let's run through our steps real quick. So let's take a look at the original claim. The mean pulse rate of adult males is equal to 69 beats per minute. Okay, so let's go ahead and write out our original claim in symbolic form. Since this has to do with the mean, we're going to have mu is equal to 69. This is our original claim. Now, what would be true if our original claim was false? Well, mu would not be equal to 69. Just write mu a little bit better. Okay. Now we have to identify the null alternative hypothesis. So now our null hypothesis, remember, always includes equals. So our null hypothesis here would be that mu is equal to 69. So now our null hypothesis is the original claim itself. And now the alternative hypothesis, remember we take a look at steps in one and two. It's the one that does not include equals. So the one that does not include equals would be the not equal to. So mu would not be equal to 69. Step four, significance level, which would be given to you, which would be given to you in the problem. Step five, identifying what we're trying to test, what's the test statistic here? Well, since this has to do with the, this has to do with the population mean. And then step six, we'd find the value of the test statistic. And since we're dealing with population mean, our test statistic is going to be a T-score. So with population proportion, it would be a z-score. In this case, since it's population mean, it's a t-score. So now let's go ahead and go to StatCrunch, and we'll find the value of this test statistic. Okay, so in StackCrunch, we're going to go to do a side by side view. Okay, we go to stat, and now we're going to go to t stats since we're dealing with the population mean. Remember, with population proportion, you go to proportion stats. So, population mean, we go to t stats. We have one sample here, and we have with summary. So, now what do we have? Okay, so now with our sample, the mean pulse rate is 70.4. So we have 70.4 for our sample mean. One second. There it goes. So I have 70.4 for my sample mean. My sample standard deviation was also given to me 10.9. And then my sample size, 150. It says 150 adult males. Now we are conducting a hypothesis test for mu, population mean. Let's go ahead and change our null hypothesis. Mu is equal to 69. And then our alternative hypothesis was mu is not equal to 69. Let's click on show critical value. Click on compute. And now we have our test statistic right over here where it says t stack. So round to two decimal places, we have 